When 21-year-old Maluchi Boat first heard Pop Smoke's music last year, he fell in love with it. As the rapper's posthumous album Shoot for the Stars Aim for the Moon was released on Friday, Maluchi tells Radio 1 Newsbeat he's grateful he has something to hold on to. I will honestly play this album to my future children. It's incredible. I'd been waiting all day for it to come out, I listened straight away. He says the release of such a special album, Pop Smoke's debut, was bittersweet. While I was really enjoying the songs, I was like wow, this is the last one I'll get to hear. The US rapper, real name Ashar Baraka Jackson, was killed in a suspected robbery in February at the age of 20. Destined for great things Caption Maluchi says Pop Smoke was destined for great things Pop Smoke only released his debut mixtape in 2019 but was already having a big impact on hip-hop. He had been co-signed by 50 Cent, who executive produced the posthumous album, which features a sample of the classic 50 Cent song Many Men, from 50's own debut album. Maluchi says. He was definitely destined for great things. If you look at what he did in about 14 months of his career, most artists do that in 5 or 6 years. Malucci's friend Jamie chimes in, The reason we love Pop Smoke so much in the UK is because he bridged the US and UK music scenes. We've had loads of UK and US collaborations before, but Pop Smoke actually used UK producers and rapped on UK drill beats. Pop Smoke often worked with East London producer Ray 8 Mello, helping give the Brooklyn artist a sound more familiar to London. Skip Twitter post by Atten Day Ixo Report End of Twitter post by Atten Day Ixo He had relationships with artists like Edge Tracy, Frito and Dave, and his previous mixtape featured a freestyle on the same beat as Heady One's iconic tune No Better. You have this unique thing with Brooklyn rap where it was created by UK production says music journalist Abu Bakar Finan. This whole new sound that was bubbling through Brooklyn was created by 808 Mellow, AXL Beats, these UK producers shaped it. Abu Bakar says originally the artists in Brooklyn didn't even know the producers were British. They were just tripping the beats off YouTube. But eventually the two subgenres evolved together mutually. And Abu Bakar says you could tell that Pop Smoke in particular made an effort to understand the UK scene. The UK has a thing where we can see who the up and coming US rap stars are, it's a weird one. Pop Smoke was the front runner in that. It's a shame we didn't see it proper come into fruition. Caption Pop Smoke performed with Skepta at shows in London, Glasgow, and Birmingham at the end of last year. Jamie felt the excitement of UK and US drill crossing over in Pop Smoke's music. He was changing the music culture, he says. Jamie thinks Pop Smoke was still evolving with every body of work and that this album contains a mix of genres. He sampled 50 Cent's Many Men, a classic tune. He's mixing old school with new school, it's so creative. It's really sad that we won't get more albums from him. Album cover controversy Malucci, like many, was glad to see the album had new cover art. Published China appoints hardline Hong Kong security chief featured why this 4th of July will be unlike any other's outrage as judge calls alleged rape victim unbecoming video protest, rally or eating out, where is riskier? Finding the invisible millions who are not on maps deciding who lives and dies in a Cape Town township sky is the limit for Pakistan's metal artist.